Well, Peter, disappointing news. You've got to cut short uh, early your contract with Essex, so returning home. Uh, what memories of playing for the club will you take back with you? Ah, I think just the enjoyment and the friendships that I've got here. I think that's the that's the reason I've always I always want to keep coming back. Is yeah, I've got a lot of close mates here now. Um, that I yeah, enjoy spending time with, um, but also playing with on the field. I think um, you know just the, the the memories that we've got from previous seasons, um, the success that we've had, um, yeah, just draws me back. It's a great club, great organisation, and yeah, sad to be going home. But um, yeah, hopefully in the in the future I can come back and, uh, and and play some more cricket for this great club. You think that door's still open for that, as far as you're concerned? Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, I, I know I'm, I'm getting to the back end of my um, career. Um, but, yeah, I've, st I've still got a, a little bit of time left in, in playing. I think um, I enjoy um, playing in England, uh, always have. Uh, so, yeah, fingers crossed. We'll see what happens over the coming months and um, uh, leading up to next season if, if, if the door's are still open and there's an opportunity there. But, um, yeah, if not, I've definitely, uh, definitely had a great time over here and been a part of this club. But... Um, um, yeah, like I said, fingers crossed there's still a little bit more cricket to be played uh, for, for Essex. Well, I think Essex marked the value that you brought to the club uh, quite recently. Gave you that county cap, presented you with a county cap, didn't you? Also got picked up your winner's medal from 2019. So they're, they're two nice memories to take back with you. Yeah, they are. It was very special, I think, you know, that the... Um, you know, receiving your county cap um, from a, a, any county is, is a memorable time and I think you know, you know how important it is um, when you get um, you know, friends and other teammates that have played with previously from other counties around the country congratulating you. I think it shows how special it is to be rewarded. Um, your, your county cap, so yeah, to, to be able to get that, the, the medal for 2019 as well on the same day, it was um, yeah very special, so it's um, like I said, there has been a hell of a lot of great memories here, um, but I think most of all is the, is the friendships that I've made um, is, is the main reason why I kept coming back. 34 wickets in eight matches in 2019, 37 wickets in seven matches in 2018, is it fair to say that, um, if you like, the effectiveness of those, the value of those, helped you get your place back in the Aussie side for the uh, Ashes series in uh, 2019? Yeah, definitely. I think that's the, the, definitely the, the main reason. Um, I think, you know, that was the, the purpose of, obviously I love coming to England, but that was the main purpose and goal I had was obviously to do well for the team. Um, but I knew if I did that, that it gave me that opportunity to be a part of that 2019 Ashes series. So, um, yeah, to to do well firstly for the team um, and perform well for Essex and get the results we did. Um, yeah, definitely um, played a big part in helping me get back in the Australian side, playing those last few tests and, and being part of that Ashes team that retained the, the urn over here was an amazing experience and yeah, definitely um, nearly all the credit goes back to yeah, Essex for, for helping me get that opportunity. But um, yeah, it's an amazing club to play for. Um, obviously you enjoy it and uh, yeah, like I said, hopefully a few more times. As you leave, hopefully only temporarily, um, you know, we have got some very exciting talent, fast bowling talent, haven't we, uh, emerging. Will you pick out one of, you know, two or three of the lads that you think could go on to make a decent career here? Yeah, I think it's, it's very exciting. I think, you know, obviously we start with the first two that I play alongside a lot is obviously Ports and and um, and little little cookie is yeah the just the way they've progressed over the years. Obviously we know Ports has always been the season campaigner, but to see um, little chef how he's performed, especially this year, uh, you know, like his last couple of years have been outstanding, but he stepped it up again this year, this season. Um, you know he's he's up there in the wicket takers, and uh, yeah, that's great to see. You like seeing young blokes come through like that, but. You know, Aaron Beard, who I played with a couple of years ago, um, is it, still going well. But then you look at Benny Allison and um, Shane Snader this season getting their opportunities in first-class cricket, um, going out there doing well, um, performing at a high level um, with bat and ball, which is which, which is exciting. You know, to have that, that talent around. So to see those guys um, to play alongside them and, and, and just give them a little bit of a helping hand, I think it's um, it, it makes it exciting for me as an old bloke to, to be able to see these guys come through and, and start their journey as a professional cricketer um, and do well and enjoy it. I think that's what makes me enjoy it as, as much as the winning and, and me doing well and the team doing well is seeing these young guys come through and start performing and, and now at the start of their career. So. Hopefully, yeah, there's going to be opportunities um, at the back end of this season um, for the boys to stand up and perform and win games for, for Essex. Um, and uh, I think, yeah, we've definitely got the talent that, that can uh, do that and continue on and, and win us games. One lasting memory of a 
the individual performance out on the field for Essex, Peter? Uh, I think, yeah, just all, all the time stepping out with the boys and, and just having wins. I think that's the, that's the exciting thing. But um, I, I think the friendships are, are, are the best thing I've made here. You know, Simon Harm has become one of my closest mates. And, um, you know, you go back five years ago, never would have thought that, you know, I'm playing, you know, in a county side with a South African um, and we're going to become good mates. So, um, yeah, obviously him. I think, you know, the, all the battles that... Um, uh, Sir Alistair and I had over the years for at the international level to then, um, you know, go out and represent um, Essex as, as teammates. Um, it, was, it was amazing because we always got along well out in the field and the, and the battles that we had. But to be able to yeah play alongside someone that I admired the way he went about and played his cricket to play alongside him and be a, be a teammate with him um, has been amazing. But like I said, all the boys have been outstanding. I think um, yeah I can't fault the club. I love the club. Love coming back, um, and yeah, hopefully, like I said, hopefully there, there's still uh, many more opportunities um, in some capacity that I do return here and, and, and play a part, whether it's next year or, or in the future. But um, yeah, I'd like to thank everyone because yeah, it's, it's been uh, outstanding and amazing uh, memories that uh, are definitely going to live on for a long time.